Friends, we are going to discuss about non-palpable undescended testes. This is in a one and a half year old boy who presented with right side non-palpable testes. The diagnostic laparoscopy was performed using 5 mm 30 degree scope through umbilicus and two 3 mm ports in a paraumbilical region in midclavicular line. The first thing is the assessment whether the testes can be brought down in single stage or two stage. We have three points which will help us in deciding whether it can come down in one operation easily or not. The first thing is we measure the distance of the testes from internal ring. If it is more than 2 to 2.5 cm, it is difficult for the testes to come down. The second point is the mobility of testicular vessels. Now in this patient by pulling the testes, Towards the scrotum, the testicular vessels are very tight and the decision is taken to do stage orchiopexy. This test is, even if it comes down in single stage, the testicular vessels will be under tension. The third point which helps us is the age of the patient. If the age of the patient is more than 5 years old, usually it is difficult for the testes to come down in single operation and it is preferred to do stage operation. However, if the mobility of vessels is very good, one can do single stage operation. Now we need to decide where we will decide, divide the testicular vessels. The ideal site is anywhere above 1.5 to 2 cm above the testes. We have to keep this distance to, for the development of the collaterals between the vassal vessels and the testicular vessels. So now we are measuring roughly the distance of the testes over the testicular vessels. So that's the site where roughly it is about 2 to 2.5 cm from the testes. And we will be deciding, dividing the vessels over there after controlling them. We routinely use bipolar forceps which is 3 mm in size, however one can use any other <coughs> form of controlling the testicular vessels which includes clips, for that you need 5 mm port, you can use harmonic scalpel, you can use lig ligatures. You can use ligature. Now the testicular vessels are controlled and they are being divided using 3 mm scissors. Usually after this we wait for 6 months for the blood supply to return back to normal. In experimental studies it takes about 1 month for the vessels testes to regain the blood supply to the normal. Thank you for your viewing.